Last time, we put ourselves uh, some mines over here. We got these getting ore for us. This one uh, is has gotten uh, some iron and some copper. This one's gotten some weird red gems and some diamonds. Uh, they kind of reset when I reload the game here, but this was in the red and this was on the uh, the gold there. And this is what the crops they gave us. And I'm, cu I'm curious. I've never seen the red before. What is, what is this red you speak of? Rough rubies. So rubies are a thing in this game. And rough sapphire. So there's gems. So the red things are gems which is probably used for uh, crafting jewelry, I imagine, to make some nice money for us. So that's a thing, but I think I probably need uh, like ores more right now. I need to get some diamonds somehow. Also, we have some, uh, we made some orange juice, so it takes, uh, okay, so we got three in each. Okay, so I thought I was confused for a second there. All kinds of goodies here, and we made some chocolate as well. We are just, uh, just juice and chocolate, uh, uh, every child's dream, right? And our trees are growing up here. I need to water those to make sure they continue to grow. We also made some scarecrows last time that can protect our crops. Those might be uh, ready to harvest down there. How do I harvest crops? What happened to the tree that was right here? Are you... It's outside of range of the scarecrow. Well, rest in peace, that one. And the others probably... How do I... Ah, I just, just right-click you, so... And we get ourselves some lovely cauliflower here. And uh, the pumpkin's not done yet, so I guess we just water you and... You take longer to grow, I suppose. And as luck would have it, orange juice is selling for maximum price, 75 bucks a pop right here. So we'll sell that and make ourselves a clean $525. And I'm not sure if that was worth it, considering how much work we put into it. And 60 bucks for chocolate, we can sell this and make another, uh, ooh, the chocolate was lucrative. Maybe there's something to be said for uh, doing some chocolate things. Rent's cheap now, but it's gonna get a lot more expensive. Also, what's our thing today? Furnaces give times two items. Wait, did I, oh, I got double chocolate, I didn't even realize. Can't uh, get more value for that. So no selling fish tomorrow, okay. The rubies, they sell, considering I don't have to do anything to process these, I mean, selling for 45 bucks is not terrible, but I think they're probably better saved for, uh, like, I, yeah, I can turn these rough sapphires into actual sapphires and make even more money. The question is, how do I do that? Do I smelt them? Is that a thing that you can do? I guess we can click this and find out, and no, you cannot smelt them. Oh, I just realized there's an arrow down here in the build menu. There's more buildings I'm unaware of. Ah, good to know. I was trying to figure out how the heck I uh, process these, and I couldn't figure it out. The quarry is how you do it. You uh, use it to process stone. I need 30 stone and 30 wood. I guess I shouldn't have sold all my wood uh, last time, but we'll be all right. Where is my stone? I don't know that I have 30 stone available. I do not, but that's a problem easily rectified by telling you guys to get me a stone. And that will become another problem for another day. In the meantime, let's go ahead and chop down some of these little chocolate trees, because cocoa is actually fairly lucrative, and I need uh, 30 wood, but chocolate is a bit of a money maker, I would say, so we want to partake of the chocolate adventures. And the question is, do I have enough wood yet? Survey says, yes. But only one tree seed. No, I know I've got 16. Okay, I got 16. Wait, do I... Wait, how do I... Maybe I had to like build like some kind of like uh... There's, there's probably some contraption to build me. I'm like, how do I keep my trees going? There's gotta be something here that like gives me more trees, right? The sawmill is used to process wood and which will give me planks and I can use planks and polished stone to craft jewelry, which is probably gonna be a big money maker with these sapphires. So I'm gonna need all these eventually. In the meantime, I'm gonna plant this little uh, thing right there and hopefully... Nope, never mind. I, I need to dig first. All right, well, let, if we're going to do that, let's just do it where you're actually kind of protecting and uh, we'll just do a little excess effort there and put, can I plant, can I plant the cocoa? Probably not, but can I plant the cocoa? Nope. All right, it's worth a shot, but tree seed go there and a lot of extra wasted space there, but whatever, it'll be fine. And just because you're messing it up there, little bush thing, be gone from this realm and give me your stuff. I should probably uh, process this, uh, these raw ores here, I think, might be, might be kind of smart, so let's go ahead and do that. Get that gold in there, get you, get you cooking. Sardines are at a pretty good price, so I'm going to just go ahead and get rid of those for some extra cash right there. And uh, try and clear up some of my inventory. I think I'm going to pass on cooking all the fish, just because it's going to be kind of tedious. Maybe like the really expensive fish, like uh, sturgeon, or better. Red molts are selling pretty well, get rid of those. Sturgeon, prepared to get cooked, like this. I got my jars back. I'm not sure if I got them back from selling my jar things or if I, I might have just had the extra jars, I think. I'm going to spend the rest of the day fishing here because we are just, uh, we got we got a lot of energy because we have bonus energy from our muscle head perk, which gives us plus 75 energy. We're up to 315, so I'm guessing you also get more energy every time you uh, uh, like pass a week because we're doing pretty well on the energy front. Achievement locked Fisherman 2. wonder what that one is. Catch 500 fishes. Is it fish? 
or fishes. I don't know. But I'm out of energy. I mean, I got a little bit left. I could do some, uh, I guess, some chopping. Clear some space. That had no stuff growing on it. Am I, should I just, like, wait for it to grow? Are there, are there seasons to it? I don't know. Put these two sturgeons away over here and have you cook for me. Carp is actually selling at full price here, so I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that for a little bit of cash infusion. We've got some more sardines there, okay? And it's time to end our day. Day six. All right, so do not sell fish today. That would be bad. Might as well grab our uh, gold and uh, baked sturgeon out of here. Oh, wow. When it says uh, uh, fish price minus 100%, they're not kidding. You can't even, not only does it sell for nothing, you can't even check to see what it sells for. I'm curious if you can sell it anyways and like it, if it'll let you. Uh, this is a waste of maybe like 50 bucks or whatever in the future, but it's only one and you can do it. It just gives you zero. Okay. I just want to see like if it'll actually let you or if the game would be like, no, uh -uh, you can't sell. It's worth zero. Still need that 30 stones. So there should be this stone over here. Ooh, interesting. We got coal with it as well. I guess it's not that interesting. I mean, it kind of makes sense, right? But I needed a, I, I just need more stone than coal per se, but I mean, I'm going to have to let you go for another day here. I'll go ahead and chop this stuff down. Make sure you don't have a, uh, you guys take up space that I want to use for other things here, huh? I mean, that's a, yeah, we're great on stone. And we're good on coal. I'll let you go one more day in the stone. That way, I just have a nice little surplus. Then I'll get you back to ore, I think. Listen, bird, I'm gonna need you to stop uh, eating my uh, trees there. That would be much appreciated. You gotta be careful where I plant those next time. To be fair, I dug it up before I knew scarecrows were a thing in the game. Although I should have known, because, well, these games always have uh, scarecrows in them. It's like a base game mechanic. Ooh, white beet seed. What's this black market? I mean, I can actually afford them now. Alchemy pot gives double items. I don't know what alchemy pot is. Spooky tools. Each tool has a 10% chance of giving you an alchemy item. That's probably good, right? I'll, I'll buy that for 3k. I mean, hopefully that's not going to be a money I desperately need later. I feel like I'm doing good to the financial front. So every time I use a tool, there's a chance of getting some uh, spooky stuff. That's cool. I have everything I need to make the quarry now. So let's go ahead and make you. Where am I going to put you at? I think I'll just toss you right, um, right there is fine, I guess. I'll probably need to cut these trees out for more space around here eventually. And you can hold four things in you. That probably just means I can put like up to four stones or four gems or rubies in you. What do I want to make first? I need polished stone for this jewelry, jewelry building, so I guess uh, stone first. It's going to take a while to get enough saved up to do that, huh? All right, I've got 107 coal. I'm wondering if it uses coal when I do it. So let's click the stone, fill it up here, so I'll have four of that tomorrow. And it does not use any stone to process it, or coal to process it. Okay. I feel like I almost need more than one of these, because four per turn is really not a lot. I'm going to go ahead and kind of chop this down. I might put more quarries around here eventually, so let's go ahead and do a little bit of clear cutting and give myself some space down here. I, ooh, rat fur. Why is Why am I... What? Spiders? Okay, I guess you can... Oh, we're finding alchemy items because of uh, that little black market upgrade we got. Okay. I see you, game. I don't know what I'm going to do with all these. Uh, used in crafting. I see I use these for making my uh, potions and whatnot. The problem I have right now is there's eating up space that I don't really have. So uh, do I sell them or do I sell other stuff and keep my like room clear? I don't know. I guess plant these seeds to make some space. Put these over here. I remember to water these things is a important thing to do. I don't actually have enough water per se. So I guess just water these ones that I can get three at a time. And well, there you go, I suppose. Did I just get... I got a spider web for watering that one up there. Okay. I am bone dry on uh, energy. I guess I'll sell the oranges to get myself some room for the old bat wing. And uh, since we're out of energy, we'll go the next day. I can actually go ahead and put some... Uh, maybe some... Uh, cook a, a bunch of copper. I don't know. I might need it eventually for something. Just go ahead and fill these up. Give myself some value there. Next day. And it is uh, lose money day. Oh no, $2,000 gone, whatever will I do? Ooh, 8,500. It does uh, scale very uh, exponentially. You stop taking my stuff. Let's uh, water first before I forget. Make sure everybody gets a uh, nice water there and nice little alchemy items for us. You guys are still growing along nicely. Okay, great. Trees uh, are kind of hard to, are kind of hard to get them back. So gotta be careful with that, I guess. Give myself a bunch of copper here. Great. And for a uh, polished stone I don't have room for, unfortunately. You alchemy items are taking up a lot of space. I can sell my baked sturgeon. That's a pretty good price, 132 bucks. I will sell those. So, achievement locked fish expert, nice. And give me those polished stone. And we're gonna put some more in there. I need I need more of you. Also, I need to get uh, all this for me. All right, we got, we're gonna have like a surplus of coal by the looks of things. I mean, I guess push comes to shove. You can always sell the extra. I'm really looking to uh, get another one of these quarries built here. Got some 
Got some uh, worms there. All right. Ooh, feathers selling for max price. I'll get rid of those and free up some space for the worms in my inventory. Just don't mind me. Got some worms just chilling in my pocket. This is how I roll. I think I'm going to keep the stone going because I'm going to be using a lot of it to make more of these. I can make another one. That's fantastic because we're definitely going to need you. It says that, uh, you can really like you can overlap these things if you want, but aesthetically, I don't want to. I don't feel like you should be able to overlap them, but there we go. And would you like to have some more stone in you as well? That's much better. Eight per turn instead of four. I'm almost tempted to kind of save it for another. I might do just that. Worms are using alchemy too. I'm getting all of these alchemy things and I don't know what I want to do with them. I guess I should build whoever does alchemy, right? These totem things are actually pretty interesting. I should probably uh, eventually start making these because they give you bonus. Water within range have plus 15% catch chance. Um, loom, use the process of wool and hide like resources destroyed within range grant plus one resource so these totems could actually be pretty useful like put them near a, a farm or something or near the fish like i can make sardine totems to get more sardines you can get quadruple the seeds the seed totems probably pretty good so i think totems are gonna be very important in this game i can make an alchemy pot gives you alchemy items every day um one rat tail one rat fur that'll pay for itself over time i imagine like just in two days they'll have probably refunded the equivalent of uh the things invested in it. So let's go ahead and uh, make just make a bunch of these alchemy pots and see what kind of weird alchemy shenanigans we can get up into and I only have enough resources for two right now, but you'll pay for yourself over time. Hey, look at that. Just giving them giving stuff back already. I'll need the alchemy stand eventually. I need to I got to get uh, the pink dyes. I need to like grow flowers for dyes or something. Dye machine makes dye out of the flower. So I need some iron bars. So let's go ahead and process some iron bars. We should probably have just have iron on there ready here. If you hold down left click it'll do it faster there it looks like i want this fish totem but i don't have enough bugs and i don't have enough planks yet so that'll be a future me's problem i guess we just go ahead and fish for the rest of the day here because that's kind of my thing that's my number one thing is fishing everything else is kind of like secondary and also just kind of like we're learning things with cg but i'm just gonna be a little fishing machine over here just getting all the fish maybe don't even have room for them all but i mean let's just go ahead and go crazy here i'll make room once i'm done Getting them all, that's great. I don't have room for these guys. I mean, the halibuts are at max price, so I can go ahead and sell those. Get some more room for these guys right here. It's already charged me my payments, so we don't have to worry about the money until next week there. The red molts are at full price. I don't feel like cooking all the fish, although that wouldn't be an awful idea for us to consider doing. I almost feel like four furnaces is not enough some days. What if I built more? I don't have the stone. If I build, if I build rat cages, I get more of these, uh, these rat resources which were used in building the, uh, yeah, like rat tail rat. So if I build rat cages, I'll get lots of rat tails and rat fur, which I can use to build lots of alchemy pots, which gives me free items. So we should probably actually start building some uh, rat cages when I have a surplus of iron bar and polished stones in the future. For now, I'm just gonna go ahead and just chop some of these, oh, never mind, we're out of energy. Next day, I was gonna chop some of those to, just to use up my the rest of my energy there, but now it's time for week three. I'm not sure if I remember to uh, water you. I, think, I guess I did, because now we have a pumpkin. And the crows over here being a nuisance because these are, again, out of its range. How is a crow managing to eat, like, a, a sapling? That does not make sense. Like, I get crows destroying the sea, but, like, the sapling? Like, come on, is this thing... This, this gets, oh, they're, they, hey, they, they grew back. All right, cool. These ones are done growing there, so it takes, like, what, four turns or something like that? Hey, we got a little... Uh, oh, it gave me two. Nice. I don't have room for you, unfortunately. I guess I can sell this pumpkin... It's not, it's not a good price, though. Anybody here selling for a nice price? Cauliflowers are sell, selling for a good price. I couldn't use them to make seeds, but I don't think we're going to do too much farming this time. Farming's not the play here, I don't think. Not in this run, anyways. I know it's called another farm roguelike, but we're actually going for fishing this run. But yeah, in future ones, ooh, we're finding all kinds of rare stuff. I don't have enough room for you all. Do I really need apples? I don't think so. They're low price, but whatever. It's a fossil used in crafting. Okay. Also alchemy. I guess I can get rid of these jars. They're not selling very well, but they're you know, only max 10, 10 price anyways. So that's fine. I'm getting all kinds of alchemy things here. I guess we're gonna go hard on alchemy. We found harvesting flowers near bee house. Neat. And get our lovely little iron right here. And our polished stone. I don't have room for you. What Wait, I thought I already had polished stone in my inventory. Where'd it, where'd it go? Must have used to, oh, I, built, I used to building these, I think. All right, pumpkin's gonna sell for a bad price, but I have an inventory crisis right now. So something's gotta go. Um. Grass, get out of here. I don't, I don't need you. All right, there we go. I need more inventory. Hello. Speak. We need to get, go ahead and get these. That 
Is there anything else in the black market? Because the black market's like, it's got some good stuff. Each time you use the shovel, you have 5% chance that honey will drop. Each time you harvest a crop, you have 25% chance that sardine will drop. I'm going to pass that because I'm not going to do too much harvesting. I mean, this is only a thousand bucks, so I don't plan to do much, do much shoveling, but we, we will occasionally replant trees and stuff. So, I mean, maybe we'll, we'll see what, like how my money situation's looking. You know, it'll be fine. We'll take it. We'll definitely get 3,000 bucks by the end of the week here, surely. And then we'll get back to chopping those. Is this another alchemy? Th How many alchemy items are there in this game? Clearly a lot. Inventory is going to be uh, a bit of a, a bit of a crisis, a bit of a problem. But, uh, I mean, good problem to have. So wherever that up black market upgrade was, it's 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 a good one. Do I really want to keep cooking up all this cocoa? I don't know what I have. I should be cooking up my ores, right? I mean, it did sell for like 60 bucks. Well, I mean, these sell for... I mean, up to 60 bucks. I think these are, I think the cocoa might just, might just sell that. Yeah, we'll pass on the chocolate for now. I have resource crises. That was a rat fur. Okay. What's a rat fur? Not much. <laughs> I'm here all day. All right, let's put our stone over here and that'll do great things for us. I have, uh, how much? I have eight polished stone. I kind of, I think I need another quarry by the looks of things because I need, what, 15 polished stone for that. I could build a sawmill right now would be... Not an awful choice. Let me build a sawmill first. You can go... Where do I want you at? I guess I can put you right there in front of it. And we'll build you up. Get a little bit of spiderweb in the, in the process. And I need... Where's my wood at? I need my wood to do that for me. And great. I feel like I'm going to need more than one of you, maybe. Stone and wood. It's stone and wood. I guess we can go ahead and chop some wood. Use up some of this extra energy I have. I'm just loaded with energy. I might as well just keep, like, you know around where this guy's at where he's gonna protect him just keep clear cutting down here and then planting back around you seems good value the problem is i don't get enough seeds out of my things unless wait 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 wait. seed machine used to make seeds from crops does an apple count as a crop and i can use it to get like another apple tree going i don't know but i'm gonna find out we're gonna put this little seed machine you can hang out oh uh, i guess you can go right there and we'll build you up, if I click the thing properly, build you up there and get a little spider out of that. Gross, right? And questions, uh, can I, like, what 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 can I put in you? For science? Fish? No, I didn't think so, but you never know. Um, where, where's my, where's my apples and stuff? Oh, I don't have room for the my inventory, okay. I have an inventory crisis. Do I sell these 10 sapphires? It's not hard to get more. Eating up space in my inventory. I guess the sardines are selling well enough. Get rid of those for now. And go ahead and pick up, let's say, the apples. And let's see if I can put the apples in here. I can. Fantastic. Okay, now we're talking. And pick up the tree seeds and plant those back, I suppose. I mean, we might as well uh, use our little hoe here to kind of just do a thing. Oh, right there is fine, whatever. That's not very efficient, but I don't think we're going to get that many seeds. And these will last in between days here. And now we put the seeds into here. We'll do a little bit of watering. Water you guys back up. These need to be watered there too, I think. And now we can go back to just kind of like clearing the land around my scarecrow dude. And we'll eventually get ourselves a nice little thing going here. Keep chopping all this. We are so much, so much just free alchemy stuff. I need to get some actual value out of that soon apart from just like eating up my inventory space, right? Sell the grass. I don't need you. Get myself the one orange. Can oranges be put in here? They can. Fantastic. So that'll help us get more like orange seeds to grow more orange trees, right? Get these little seeds right here and I'll put you guys here and here and then I'll go over and water you. And we're doing great. More apples, but I don't have any room to put you in there. But I do need to keep those. I need, I need those. Get rid of the sand for now. We'll get, we'll get more of it. Although, oh, I should put the sand in the furnace. That was dumb. All right, whatever. It's fine. We'll figure it out over time. I'm going to need more seed machines. Five iron bars. So we need to, need to cook us up some iron over here be a good thing to do and just fill this up. Fantastic. Furnace user one, she been locked. I think we're pretty much out of energy here. Can I like do any final uh, chopping of something before we go? But that might create more of an inventory crisis unless I chop, uh, so I, uh chop like mine. Nope, I'm out of energy, okay. All right, then I suppose we go over to our next day here. Welcome to week three, day two. Oh, it's our upgrade day. Ooh, if only I had more money. Uh, Or, or no, wait. Day end. Oh, wait, no, I, th I thought this was going to end the entire week. Interest. Day ends immediately. Next week, you will get three upgrades. So I miss out on an upgrade for this week. And um, I don't get to 
I miss out on an entire day's worth of productivity, but I'll end up having, you know, I, I could get one upgrade this week and then one upgrade next week, or I can have a total of three. So like one additional upgrade overall. I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna do that. Um, and like we're, we're okay on money. Missing one day of productivity here will be just fine for us and we'll get extra upgrades in the future. But I think that's a good spot to wrap it up. Uh, smash that like button. Let's go.